Plus, breaking news of mass shooting in the Bronx. Six people shot after a subway altercation. Now we've learned it has turned deadly. News for Ida Siegel just got to the Mount Eaton station. She joins us now live. Ida? And Chuck and Natalie, I want to show you a little bit of the scene where we are. This is the Mount Eden subway stop off of Jerome Avenue in the Bronx. There is a heavy police presence here. You can see investigators still here at the bottom of the train station. This is an elevated subway station, the number four train. And so there is lots of activity going up and down into the subway station. Here's what we know. Six people were shot on or outside of a number six train this evening right here at the Mount Eden stop. And yes, police are now telling us one of those gunshot victims was killed. Law enforcement sources say this started with a fight of some sort on the train itself and then spilled onto the subway platform. Shortly thereafter, gunshots were fired and sources say preliminarily it appears as though most of the victims here, the gunshot victims, are teenagers. I want to show you some cell phone video that we just got our hands on uh, in the last few minutes. And in this video, you can see a first responder running from the train station with a clearly injured teenage girl. We don't know the extent of her injuries. Sources say a 911 caller reported that at least one gunshot victim was hit in the face. Uh, we don't know the age of the person who was killed or what prompted the shooting at this point, but lots of people here who were waiting for the subway during the rush hour started running for their lives. Take a listen. I was on the train just standing there and I went, I heard six of them. Six of? Gunshot. And then when I heard it, I just went downstairs. I heard one person screaming or something. And so I went downstairs. I don't want to get hit in the... So again, according to law enforcement sources and actually multiple witnesses, we had a handful of teenagers who were shot in the vicinity of the subway station. Uh, I'm told by witnesses at least two of the victims were teenage girls or appeared to be teenage girls. Uh, police are still trying to put all of this information together for us, and we're expecting to have more information shortly as they are planning for a news conference. Interestingly, it looks like subway still service is still running here. We have seen six trains, uh, rather four trains, Trains go by as we've been here in the last few minutes. But that's the very latest, uh, very latest reporting from um, the Bronx. Ida Siegel, News 4, New York.